The Nokia 2.4 is a very popular device in the latter half of 2020. With the Nokia 2.4, you get a lot of value for money. But one thing many people who have purchased one ask themselves is, where's the back button? The Nokia 2.4, as you can see, uses Android One, but there's no navigation bar. There's no buttons at the bottom for back, home, and multitasking. That's because Nokia has essentially moved everything to gesture navigation. This is part of Google's evolution of Android, is you have gesture navigation rather than the buttons at the bottom. So what I'm going to do in this video is walk you through how to enable the good old back, home and multitasking buttons on the Nokia 2.4. So the first thing to do, the easiest way to do it is to pull down the notification shade and then pull it down again. And you'll see that there's a little cog button at the bottom right hand corner of the notification shade. So tap that and that will open up your settings. Now, you'll have quite a long list of settings, but thankfully, Google's Android One is really easy to navigate, and it's really easy to find settings. So we're going to search for navigation, and then if it comes up as a suggested one, you have an option for suggested navigation, system gestures, system navigation. So tap on that, and you'll see that you come to a screen where you have two options in how to go about your system navigation. The first is gesture navigation. It's what comes on as default. But if you prefer three button navigation, all you need to do is tap on that option. And essentially what that should do is enable the three buttons at the bottom of your Nokia 2.4. You can then just tap the home button in the middle and it may take a few seconds for the device and the operating system to update but once you've done that essentially you have set your phone to be with button navigation so what you can do is if you have any apps open press the button on the right to scroll through your open apps as you used to press the home button and you have that magic back button that's one of the top features of Android, especially compared to iOS, is having a back button. So if you're wondering how to enable the back button on the Nokia 2.4, hopefully this video was useful to you. I'm Matteo, the chief mobile opinionist here at Tech Travel Geeks, and hopefully this was useful to you. If you don't already, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on YouTube. We will be concluding our full long-term review of the Nokia 2.4 very, very soon. So be sure to be subscribed and have that bell notification mashed to ensure you get notified of when we do publish that video. But for now, thanks for watching and goodbye.